It's time to dust off your favourite chair and sit in front of the big screen TV. Get a drink in your hand because it's five o'clock somewhere. Your number one host, the thunder from down under, the man on a quest to make money for beer. Can the most electrifying manager in sports entertainment, the man they call Fabio, take Sutton United all the way to the Champions League final? Well, let's find out in today's episode of the Youth Edition. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Youth Edition Career Mode here with Sutton United. We sit top of the table, five points clear of Liverpool in a pretty good position to strike. Uh, still half the season remaining, a lot of games to play. But today's episode, we kick off our FA Cup uh, against West Brom. We've got both legs of the semi-final of the Carabao Cup against Newcastle. And uh, in between all that, I think we've got a game here against Wolves. Transfer window open. We are trying to offload some players. It's a fire sale here at Sutton. So let's jump into today's episode. We kick things off. It's the round three of the FA Cup. We've got West Brom, three and a half star team. 4-2-3-1 wide formation. They're using a press. Right, and we are going to send out our reserve squad with the Newcastle game coming up next. Carabao Cup semi-final. We do want to go through in the FA Cup, but uh, hopefully this team can take care of it. Uh, Lindstrom, Kawasaki, Santosh across the front. Kerbinov and Labashang in the midfield. Um, Andre Eon is in today. And let's see if we can just get through West Brom. All right, ladies and gentlemen, FA Cup time. Another competition, another chance at silverware. Good from Andre Eon. Labashank. Kawasaki. He'll just lay one throw. And here goes Lindstrom. The breakaway for Sutton. Lindstrom into the box. And there is the opening goal of the day. 1 0 Sutton. We should be able to walk in the park here, you'd hope. Ninth goal of the season for Lindstrom. And that is a pretty decent effort from a spare parts player, to be fair. He just blazed away from this West Brom defence. Good finish, 1-0. Zacharias it down to Kerbinov, down to Labashank. Across here for Lindstrom, back for Kerbinov, lays it through, Kawasaki. Oh, sidebar, Labashank. Has it back, Jakobsen, Lindstrom. There's Kawasaki. Oh, there's the goal. 2-0 <laughs> <laughs> Sutton. West Brom with no answer to this strike force. And Kawasaki has his uh, ninth goal of the season. It's 2-0 Sutton. And this one looking like now it might be just a formality. We are running right. Here again to Green Lane. Jakobsen, Lindstrom with the assist, but Kawasaki's turning ability. Good finish. 2-0. Lindstrom. Labashank. Zachariasen pushes his way forward, lays it through onto the arches of Kawasaki. Oh, cracking save from Palmer. Kerbinov drives it in. Kawasaki, oh, another good save. That keep is pretty decent. Kawasaki over the top. Can Lindstrom get here in time? No, picked off as far as Kawasaki. Zachariasen, oh, there's the pass picked off. It's 2-0 at halftime. Just sitting in second gear, really. Andre Eon gets the header away. We'll try and have a crack here. But Jakobsen in, does his work. Santosh plays it forward. Here's Kawasaki. He's held up. The touch. Lindstrom. Kawasaki plays it off. Labashank trying to push his way forward. Plays it off now. Kawasaki. Bang. That'll be his 10th uh, of the season. It's 3 0 Sutton. And I uh, tell you what, we've put together some sort of a squad here. Seven seasons in control, some good recruiting. And we've now got a fully firing reserves team that seems to be able to do a job for us. The ball inside from Labashank. And Kawasaki with the finish, 3 0. Oh, Andre on beautiful defense. Labashank, Kawasaki. Lays it through. Lucas Santosh in on goal. Drives his way in. Santosh. 4 0 Sutton. Santos has his third of the season. Well, we'll be going through to the next round of the FA Cup. This is a team in red hot form in all competitions at the moment. 
counter-attack football. Gunslingers here at Sutton United. Lovely class little finish there from Lucas Santos. 4-0. Lavashank plays one forward under the shoulder of Kawasaki. He's away. He's gone. Let's go, Kawasaki. Get yourself a hat-trick, lad. Hey! 5-0 Sutton. Kenji Kawasaki. Let's go, lad. There's a big man on campus coming through in the shadows of Kelvin. But hey, he's scoring goals as well. It's really nice to see. Break away here from Kawasaki. They weren't catching him. Get in there. Well, let's make some changes. Let's get some sharpness and minutes into the lads. Ten minutes to go. Go from Ethan Thompson. Hot up. Have to find Kawasaki. Picked out. This has been a, a solid day at the office here. And there is the whistle. 5-0 Sutton. Kawasaki with a hat-trick in the FA Cup. And we are through to the next round. Andy Kawasaki, what will he be like in the future? <laughs> 10 shots. Okay, probably should add a few more. 18 shots to one. Oh, dear. Eight saves from their keeper, though. Good effort. Kenji Kawasaki, what a game. Three goals, two assists, perfect 10. Labashang, two assists. Santos got a goal. Lindstrom, a goal and an assist. Yakerson was good. Swanee only gets a 6.8, but he didn't have to do anything today. And, uh, yep, everyone that checked in kind of played a role. We move on. Right then, Victor Avanauskas has been sold. He's gone to Freiburg for 4.6 million. Right, semi-finals, EFL Cup. It's over two legs, don't forget. Uh, four and a half star, a little bit quiet here by the looks of things from Newcastle. Uh, Tonali on the bench is an interesting call, but 4-3-3 uh, three, three flat formation, and they're using a press. Right then, first legs at James's Park. Uh, we rested a lot of players for this one. Kadlic uh, a little bit down on sharpness, but hopefully he's fine for this one. Um, yeah, Coleman 88, Potter 89. He's the highest rated player now at the club. And uh, we're going to try and see what we can do here in the semi-final of the Carabao Cup. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Class should be okay. Different Cadlets. Hot up. Coleman. Out to Cadlets. He's going to try and push here. He's not the quickest of lads, but he might be able to get the opening goal. 1-0 Sutton. No one can handle our counter-attack. It's in there. Cadlets only his third goal for the season. Jesus. It's just like the defenders just slow down. They're like, what? What just the fuck happened there? Where did he come from? Cadlets from deep in the midfield makes a majestic run. That's a cracking finish. 1-0, the perfect start. Oh, Andre Eon just gets in the way. Hardy feeds it out. Wants Molotov. Oh, straight through. Go on, Molotov. Massive maneuvers. Works his way forward. He can look back for Coleman. No, great defending. Here comes Newcastle. Pushes inside. Kone. Beautiful stuff. Oh, picked off again. Newcastle press. Minter. Come on, Andre. Yes. Eon. Beautiful stuff. Well, they keep pushing forward. And that might open up some space around the back here for Molotov. Molotov keeps on running. Coleman needs to get into a position to shoot this time. Back in. Martinez makes the save. Stojanovic. Caught up to Cadlitz. Oh, we're on the break. Half time. 1 0 to Sutton. Oh, great save, Swanee. One one. Newcastle finds a way through. The game's changed since Tonali checked in. Just pushed past Andre Yon. That's a low grubber. On the right hand side that beats Swanee. One one. Fucking game on. Turns it inside. Coleman turns his man. Coleman! There's the fucking finish! 2 1 Sutton. Coleman does it again. 32 for the season for the fridge. That's a clean finish. And that's what we needed. We needed a little bit of a lead here. Coleman 1v1 just turns it on. He doesn't turn like a fridge. But he fucking is one. 
Two one. Oh, Hardy, brilliant. Coleman lays it off quickly. Quick thinking from Coleman. Tenali trying to run him down. Taylor Potter. Oh. Swanny with the catch. Who won Sutton at St. James's Park? We take a one goal lead into the second leg. Newcastle with the possession. 14 shots to two. Eight saves from Martinez. Coleman comes up with the man of the match performance with a goal and an assist. Hardy 7 7. Kadlich with a goal. Kone with an assist. Swanny only a 5.9. The poor lad. Ezio Auditore has been sold. He has gone to Aston Villa for 63 million. Wow. Big money. Game three today. We're taking on Wolves, a four and a half star team sitting in 16th place. 4 4 1 1 formation. Farina is in at centre back. Fresh transfer for them. And they're using wing play. All right, we go to the Molyneux. I'm going to send the reserves out. Let everyone uh, stay fresh and ready for the second leg of the Carabao Cup. So let's get into this one and see if we can find the points. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Let's hope Kenji Kawasaki can continue his FA Cup form here today against Wolves. Santos to deliver the corner. Lifts it up. Andre Eon. Oh, yes. Hello. 1 0 Sutton. Andre Eon gets his third goal of the season. And then Sutton has the lead. Santos just put it up. Big Andre Eon, rising majestically. Keeper got a finger on it, couldn't keep it out. 1-0 Sutton. Gerbanov gets the steal. Flicks it over the top, Kenji Kawasaki. Oh, Kenji Kawasaki! 2-0 Sutton. 12 for the season for Kawasaki. Oh, Sutton are up and about, boys. Sutton are up and about. Is this our year? If the reserves are doing this kind of mischief, definitely. There are things on the cards. Touch wood. And Santosh. Kawasaki. Oh, my days. He's got the skills to pay the bills. Oh, fucking hell! Kawasaki! 13 for the season. 3-0 Sutton. Ooh, that was disgusting. How did he just weave his way through the traffic? Through the legs of Lindstrom. Keeper has no idea what the fuck just happened. And it's 3-0. Sutton United. Ah. 3-1, no clean sheet for Swan. Andre Eon probably left him out to dry my... Running the length of the pitch. Moves back in the game. Farina, the former Sun man there, celebrating. You can see Andre Eon almost got back. Kruger tried to throw a big leg in. Andre Eon actually putting the pressure on, so he's done well to get back there. But yeah, you've, you've hung Swanee out to dry, mate. 3 1. Wolves trying to find an opening. Kerbinov does well. There we go. Half time whistle. 3 1 Sutton. One of the Wolves. Overshank with the clearance. Good from Lindstrom. And Kerbinov can come. Not much left in the tank, though, for Kerbinov. He's going to run out of legs here for Rena. Well, he's played it off for Lindstrom. And that'll be a breakaway finish. 4 1. Lindstrom on the board. And a 10 for the season for him. And Sutton have a 4 1 lead here. In this Premier League fixture. Kerbinov's just about out of legs, but gets it through for Lindstrom, composes himself. Yeah, I think that is 10 for the season. Gets in, lad. Well, let's make a couple of changes. Cadlitz for Kerbinov. And Labashang is out for Ethan Thompson. Corner for Sutton, Santos to deliver. And look for Andre Eon. Oh, he's got his second. 5-1 Sutton. Andre Eon, four for the season. Well, you know he's in the box. There's always a chance that he's going to get on the end of it. Lovely finish. Another wonderful set piece from Sutton. Santos with perfect pinpoint delivery. Just put it on his head. 4-1. One, plays it off. Andre Eon. Santosh. 
Jakobsen working into the box. We've got a couple of players up here. He delivers it in. Kenji Kawasaki! Let's go! 6-1. Another hat-trick for Kawasaki. 14 for the season, I think. Lovely delivery from Santosh. You get the feeling now that with the depth that is starting to show up, this is a team that is going to be hard to beat for a long time. 6-1. Oh, 20 minutes ago, we'll make some changes, freshen things up. Lindstrom, Ferdinand and Kruger check out. Otto Stojanovic and Kone checking in at 6-1 up. Oh, Kawasaki takes on Farina. Kawasaki, good save. Late corner here for Sutton. Santos to deliver. He'll look for Kone. Farina got up. Padlets. And that's cleared away. And there's the whistle. 6-1 Sutton. Kenji Kawasaki. He's done it again. Not pretty even possession, but 17 shots to six. Bang. All right, Kenji Kawasaki, man of the match with a perfect 10. Andre Eon, 9.9. Two goals. Beautiful. Four assists for Santosh. Huge. Kerbin over two assists. Lindstrom with a goal as well. This one gets a 6.7. And uh, Kruger, who started, only gets a 5.8. That's pretty average. Right, Joel Fraga has gone on a short loan. The backup goalkeeper off to Bristol City. Ricardo Benilla, he's been sold. We've sold him to Burnley for 26.7 million. Right then, Youth Academy reports came back. Not that we're really looking to sign anyone up, but we get to the end of this season and it is the last one. We will uh, pump all of these lads into the save. Not the greatest, but uh, some okay options. Archie Andrews, 59 rated cam, 69 to 94 potential. Portuguese winner, winger in Camilo Pinto, uh, 64 rated, 68 to 94 potential. And uh, Fabial Fernandes from Portugal, 61 rated, 71 to 94 striker. Now, it was the end of that scouting mission, and I'm kind of at a point now where I think let's just hold off on scouting. Um, I think there's enough in this save for now. So uh, we'll just pause. If there is another season with Sutton, we will continue then. But for now, we're going to hold on the youth scouting. Right, Mamahat Faki has gone to Strasbourg. 3.4 million. Sun Wang Tang has been sold. He's gone to Paris Saint-Germain for 46.2 million. I'll tell you what, the Sutton owners are rolling in cash with the amount of sales we've made this season. Paul Fox has been sold. He's gone to Istanbul Spore for 1.9 million. I think he's the, the striker from Bermuda from memory. Ali Khalifa has been sold. He's gone to VFL Wolfsburg for 3.5 million. Robbie Riddell has been sold. He's gone to PSE's Wall. Only 550 grand. Quite low rated, but it's got some decent potential. Could get some growth there if he gets some minutes. Right then, second leg of the Carabao Cup, the final game today. And if we get through this, it means we get a chance to go to Wembley. 4-3-3 flat. We know what they're all about. They're starting to nully on the bench again. And they're using a press. Right, so a 2-1 aggregate score. We're here at Gander Green Lane. Coleman's hit an 89 as well. Oh, disgusting. Uh, this team is looking quite delicious. Let's see if we can get over the line and get ourselves to Wembley. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we know what we need to do. Let's get down to business. Go from Hardy. Got stuck in. Potter's so got some space to run again. They're giving him a lot of time here on the outside. Taylor Potter wheels around his man. Here's Taylor Potter, lays it across, and there is the goal. Well, 1 0 on the day, 3 2, the aggregate score. Sweaty across for Coleman. 33, maybe, for the campaign. And we've got a two goal lead. And one foot in the door of Wembley. Little pot up. It's just growing from strength to strength. Don't forget, the frame's still out injured, so we've got more firepower to come back. Let's do this. Oh, Hardy. He's freaking everywhere. Just lays it out in front. Taylor Potter making a run again. Taylor Potter delivers this one deep. Coleman. Oh, fucking scintillating football. 2-0 Sutton, Coleman with another one. We are on song here in front of the home fans. In the fridge, seems to be scoring for fun. Lovely delivery from Potter, look how much space Coleman had. He just had to get the precision right and he did. 
2-0 on the day. 4-1 the aggregate. Cadlitz. Did well. Push around the outside. Go on, Cadlitz. Drives his way forward. Brings it deep. On the top can't get in. Half time. Sutton in control. Coronate down to Cadlitz. Gets it off for a pot up. Finds Jake Hardy! 3 0 on the day. 5 1 the aggregate score. Jake Hardy has his fourth of the season. Sutton United. It's just a team of absolute beasts. We've built something special here. Hardy with the finish. And Sutton will be going to Wembley. Zacharyson does well. That's Hardy. Make Hardy. Walks his way forward here. Oh, there he is, boys! There he fucking is! We've been waiting. A big effort from Jake Hardy. Gets his second on the day. And that's five for the season. Jesus, we're firing on all cylinders. Let's fucking go. Jackson. Slips it out here. Molotov. It's his run on. Still comes Molotov. Delivers it back. Cadlitz. Oh, it's all Sutton. 5 0. Cadlitz saying uh, that's his fourth of the season. Still 10 minutes to go in this one, but Sutton running right and really setting themselves up here for the perfect campaign. Gets in. It's at 5 0 on the day. There's Cadlitz. Plays it on for Zachariasen. Plays it in here for Coleman. And no. And that should be it. 7 1 the aggregate score. 5 0 Sutton, and we're going to Wembley. Newcastle with all the possession. We had all the shots and all the goals. Well, Taylor Potter, man of the match with three assists. Hardy got two goals and a 9.4. Coleman a nine with the two goals. Kadlic a goal. Molotov an assist. Zachariasen with an assist. And we didn't make any subs. All right, Van Cam has been sold. He has gone to Swansea City for 4.8 million. It is transfer deadline day. Benjamin Barnett, the uh, English centre forward. He heads off to Blackpool for 2.1. Right then, the transfer window is shut. I don't even know how many players we sold. Something like 35 or something. Cook goes to Bristol City for 5.1. Martin to Trabs and Spore for 3.9. Borges to Southampton for 1.7. Sonkang to Selatana, 4.2. Seldana goes to Man City for 6.1. Adil goes to Arsenal for 6.3. Elvis to Brighton for 5.9. Rubio to AC Milan for 6.3. Yassin to Dusseldorf for 4.1. Mm, that's a loan for Bolton. Uh, Van der Waal goes to Real Madrid for 5.5. Jones to PSV for 10.5 million. Stone goes to Leeds on loan. Thapa to Bournemouth for 17.3. Moussa to Blackpool for 4.2. Mariotti to AS St. Etienne for a million. Farina goes to Wolves for 9.4. Avanauskas to Freiburg for 4.6. Auditore to Aston Villa for 63 million. Fraga goes out on loan as well to Bristol City. Vanilla gets sold. He's gone to Burnley for 26.7 million. Faki goes to Strasbourg for 3.4. Tang to PSG for 46.2. Fox goes to Istanbul Spore for 1.9. Khalifa to Wolfsburg for 3.5. Riddell as well for 550 grand. Cam goes to Swansea City for 4.8. Barnett to Blackpool was the final sale, 2.1. So we sold a couple to Blackpool. Watch out for them in the future. Right, and that leaves us with only a 26-man squad. Nice. So, Swanee, up 4 to an 85. Fraga out on loan at a 69. And Bolton out on loan, 66. Stojanovic up 2 to an 87. We've got Ferdinand up 2 to a 75 with the potential to be special. Kone's up 1 to an 86. Andre Eon up 3 to an 88. Kruger up 6 to a 77. Now, there's only three centre-backs here, but I've got a plan. Jackson up 2 to an 86. Jakobsen up 1 to an 80. Potential to be special. Kadlitz up 2 to an 85. Jorgensen, we're going to convert to a centre-back. Uh, I think he's only five foot ten, but um, that's fine. That'll give them a little bit more depth. And then Zachariasen up three to an eighty-six. 
Take Hardy up two to an 84. Thompson up two to a 79. Kerbinov up two to an 81. Labashang up two to a 78. Taylor Potter up three to an 89. Dufresne, he's only up one. He has dropped a rating to an 87. He's still four weeks away. Lindstrom up one to a 78. Uh, Santosh up one to an 86. Molotov up one to an 88. Holly Stone's on loan up two to a 75. Coleman's up four to an 89. Kenji Kawasaki up two to a 77. And Darren Brockman up one to a 67. Pretty decent looking squad. All right, the Carabao Cup fixture for the final will be against Liverpool. So something to look out for. Possibly our first piece of silverware. In the FA Cup fourth round, we've drawn Watford. And in the Premier League, well, we are seven points clear of Liverpool. And uh, we've got uh, FA Cup coming up next, I believe. The Champions League's going to kick off soon. Uh, we've got Leicester City on the horizon. And we've got Brentford as well. But uh, the way we've been playing, uh, we're almost an unstoppable force. Well, that's where we leave you today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We'll see you in the next. I'm Sparring DK. It's five o'clock somewhere. And you have a good one. The Sparring DK channel now has Patreon. And if you feel like just going that little extra step to help, uh, you know, the channel grow, you can go across to the website, pledge your allegiance to myself. And uh, for $1 a month, you're basically putting it in a jar and allowing for us to go and buy some more beers and record some more beer drinking episodes. Thank you very much to the current lads that have gone ahead and supported the channel. Absolutely tremendous to see anybody willing just to give that $1 a month at this stage. I cannot thank you from the bottom of my heart. You, you really will make a difference in the future. So jump across there if you're that way inclined to the Patreon channel. Sign up today and we'll see if we can get some extra beer drinking episodes for you at home. Now if you are looking for some more content, we've got a couple of videos. One here, one here. And if you want to subscribe, there's a button right there. So go ahead, subscribe and you'll be notified when the videos go live. Make sure you put on that notifications bell. We'll see you next time.